We have our debate. We have our argument. We are vo voting for over here. Who is the defendant? Who is who are we saying is the villain? Victor. Victor is the villain. Who are you arguing? The progeny. The progeny. Who's correct? Me. Me. We are oh. They're wrong. Nobody. Okay. The All right. answer is nobody. Nobody. The answer is nobody? So you are arguing that Victor's the true antagonist. Why do you say that? I am telling you right now, I'm doing no talking. Minimal to no talking. This is a student-led discussion. I'm only going to jump in if there's a physical altercation where it's just getting so heated. You're like, Victor's the... I'll only jump in for that, okay? So, uh, who says... Who's right again? Who's right? We are right. We are right. We are Why are you right, Paige? Why are you right, Paige? Get ready for rebuttal. Now, what we have before we begin, we have these papers also. Yeah, but. Interesting and wait. You are using at least two of these in your discussion. Now, these are used in different ways. If Olivia makes a statement and you're like, okay, I see where you went, but I interpreted this another way, you would say, yeah, but this is what I came up with. Or yeah, but what if you saw it this way? Or yeah, but did you consider this? Yeah, but. Also is I'd like to add something. So Olivia, you make a great point, but oh, Paige remembered something else that also builds off of it. I'd like to add off of that. Or Gabe, you're like, okay, that's a great point. Also, uh, this is something that's important to consider as well because this is gonna set your argument in the future. Interesting is, okay, didn't think about it that way. I didn't think about that at all that way. So interesting is when you want to say, that's an interesting uh, bit of information. This is how I interpreted it, or this is something that I found interesting as well about what you pointed out, plot event. And wait, I have no idea what you just said. Let's start over. Wait, what, can you repeat with yourself? So wait is I have a question or I have a clarification I need. So wait is you need uh, to interrupt so that you can have a question answered. You're going to throw them in to the middle. Okay, you're gonna throw them into the middle when you have to interject, all right? You're using at least two, at least two. It is 9.03, we're going until at least 9.14. 10 minute debate, okay? So, continuing really fast, who, who said they were correct? Us. Oh, Me. Us. We are correct. You're correct. Really good, because you sound pretty confident. Doug, you don't sound confident at all. Oh, I was. Uh, I was days you're, you're correct? I think. Okay, why are you correct, Jesse? You tell them why they're wrong. Wait, so I'm on the monster side, right? I think the monster's a bad guy. Yeah, you think the monster's a bad guy. Yeah, so what do you think? And begin. Well, I think he's bad because he's still, he like, Grab little kids and like try to steal them and make them sidekicks and stuff and like murder people and like tell them don't worry tell them and then like Victor he like he regretted making the monster you know? he thought it was a bad thing he didn't think it was too good after a while and then like that monster started killing people and stuff and that's not good a lot of people regret killing people that doesn't make them good they still kill people <laughs> that monster it's a monster well Victor's the one who created him. The monster killed people and felt like nothing for it. He's just like, I'm about to kill you and your whole family, and like did it. He didn't even care. Yeah. Sure, it's out of revenge, but like, that doesn't make him like. It doesn't mean it's justifiable. It's still interesting. <laughs> it is but, interesting. Like, what if he didn't have like a brain? Like, what if he was just dumb? He was just like, oh, I killed him, whatever. That doesn't mean you're allowed to just go <laughs> kill people that had like. Okay, the people he was killing had literally nothing to do with the creation of him. They're just related to the guy, the Victor guy. Yeah, but also, um, when Victor first created Duck, he literally, from the very beginning, he looked at him and was like, I don't like what I created, you're ugly. And Duck was like, Oh my god, they think I'm ugly. And that triggered his anger from the start. So that's where all his anger came from. And then afterwards, he goes ahead and Duck's like, I want you to create another me. So um, Victor goes ahead, he starts doing it, then he regrets it. And while he's looking directly at Duck, he rips the thing apart. And right then and there is when Duck was like, okay, now I'm going to go get revenge. So it literally all starts from the very beginning. 
that's an amazing point. And to add on to the thing about when he created it and then like immediately like shunned it, basically, when he told him like, oh, this is disgusting. Imagine if you had a kid and your kid turned out ugly. So you look at the thing and go, you, I regret making you. Like, what kind of a parent are Interesting you? Interesting what the truth hurts. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you're right, man. You're right. Okay, yeah, but um, Victor created um, Frankenstein, uh, not Frankenstein, um, the progeny, but your mom also created you. But if you were to murder, would you get in trouble or would your mom get in trouble? That's a good point, man. He's got you there. How are you going to respond to that, Alex? Come on, Alex. You got it. Listen, Frankenstein is very bad. Think about this. Married his stepsister. He also <laughs> dug up church bodies. He went to a church and just started digging up bodies. That's it. Religious. So then he could create all the other things that are out there, whatever they are. He married his stepsister. That, that just, that's that's worse than killing people. That's Sweet Home Alabama. Straight up. Yeah, yeah. but They're not really this was back in the day, so. Yeah. 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 No, it was no. 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 the time this was written. It's not cool to marry your stepsister. Yes, it was. <laughs> <laughs> it was, I don't it was cool. Yeah. Yeah. I don't care. They had the spotted shoes. I still don't care. You can kill people all you want, but as soon as you start marrying your stepsister, I'm out. Yeah, but, but. The reason he was in that grave digging up people is because he was not mentally stable. He wanted to keep on learning about the wrong thing. Yeah, yeah, you that's our point. That's literally our point. That's literally the point we're making. So it's not his fault that he. No. Yes, it is. You just, you <laughs> just are great to our dude, side, bro. Straight up, and you're crazy. Like that, 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 that doesn't mean that you can't like control yourself. Maybe a bit hard, but you can still do it. And that doesn't justify you like creating something like that and then you're just like rejecting it. Like, that doesn't justify it. Like, don't yeah. sit here like, oh, Ted Bundy, you know, he may have raped all those chicks and killed them, but like, he's crazy, so you can't get mad at him. What? Who's yeah, who's doing that? Yeah, no, I was like, no, lock that. that guy up. <laughs> okay, so just because. Hold on. Yeah. Wait. Um, oh. I really, uh, I don't know, I don't I want to say stuff, but like, I don't know if people already said it, so I don't Oh, you just it. jump in and say it. Yeah, you just um, go. Um, but then, you know, the question, you know, like, you killed Victor and Elizabeth and William. He, he didn't really, he didn't really kill Victor. Yeah. He did it as a way to, like, Resolve everything. It'd be right. different if, like, you have a traitor, by the way. So, think about this. Wow. Oh, he framed! He framed the maid! He knew what he was doing! He framed the maid! No, he framed it. Did, it. did he not frame the he maid? He did frame the maid. He framed the maid, got her thrown in jail. Think about that. Also, what I'm saying! Also, he, uh, he not only killed William, he killed Elizabeth and Frankenstein's dad indirectly, but, like, he killed all these people um, and. He led Frankenstein in on a goose chase around the world. But it also Frankenstein goes back. Yeah, but it also goes back. Created. It doesn't matter what someone's actions are. It literally all goes back to the very beginning of when everything first happened. So are you saying if somebody has a bad childhood, they can come in? Oh, murder? Matthew's a traitor too. So Victor. Victor devoted his life to create what he made. He was regretful of what he made. He didn't involve. He didn't have any say in the choices that um, the progeny had. Yes, he did. No, he yes, never he told did. any. He didn't tell him to murder anyone. But he made, he came up with all. He literally decisions. put his anger on Duck the entire time. He literally was like, "You're ugly. I don't like you." And then Duck was like, "Oh my god." And as I literally said, which I will restate it again, as he created the second, because Duck wanted that second creation, he created it, goes ahead, looks Duck directly in the eyes, rips it apart, and is like, I can't do this. Right from there, that is when he got angry, and then he's like, that's it. I'm killing everyone you love. You'll find me at your wedding. 
everything. That's and that's where it's Why, why would you want a second progeny running around? Would you want a second person that would murder No, but would I around? want my like half my family to be killed and then me end up wanting to die? How do you know he would have kept his promise? See. How do you know he would have kept his promise and not have murdered and just take the second progeny and you also murder more people and you just create two murders? Victor is not a bad guy because when he started this whole thing and he wanted to like build a human being from scratch, he thought it would have been cool and it could have helped out the earth. He didn't know it was going to go south. It went south, but we didn't know that. So he's not a bad guy from heart. He's just a little messed up in that. Olivia, oh, no. Olivia, you made a bad argument. You were like, yeah, yeah, all these bad things happened, but it all started when my boy Victor made the guy. You can't sit here and blame like current events on something that happened like a hundred years ago. Sure, that may have laid like a foundation and may have like caused the string of events, but that is not the thing that happened a day ago. That's the thing that happened a long time ago. You can't sit here and make that the, the foundation of your argument, even if it's the foundation of a string of events. Things change. What? Shut up. That's what's up. So, you know what I'm saying? So back to like up. Frankenstein oh, ripping. Oh, ripping oh, bad, bro. Oh, you got a thing. He also like he ripped him up because Frankenstein. I mean, the prodigy duck was forcing him to create it, or else he would be killed. So he was. He was. He was forcing Victor. Yeah, to the do creator. It. Well, no, the creation was forcing Victor to make like this life, or else he was going to get killed. So, oh, no. so no, Matt. So, so wait a minute. So what's so what's your point when saying that? Like, I don't get your point. What does that have to do? So it doesn't make Victor okay. bad for like wanting to tear the creation that he's being forced to make, or else he's gonna get killed. Yeah, but look what happened after he didn't make it. Look at what happened. His wife died creation. after one day of being married. Then he goes and tries to go and talk to his dad. Well, then his dad dies right then and there. And then beforehand, two other people die, which is his family, all because of that. But he's being yeah. black here. I don't care. Ding, ding, ding. That was awesome. That was really great. Thank yeah. you. And I'm still on my side, and I will forever be on my side. Hey, just right. That was yeah. awesome. We have.